Hello boys and girls, my name is HotSST and welcome to another day in Minecraft. As you can see, I've done some work on my uh, Minecraft skin. Uh, wanted to do that a long time, but finally got around to it. And I also installed Optifine so I can get right into your face, right? But that's not uh, the main reason for installing Optifine. The main reason is connected cloth textures. I really like that and I think uh, that's something that we need for the uh, uh, glass fog effect uh, in the ravine. And I know I went on harping about the uh, color coding all your shulker boxes and all I've done is the red box over here but I just haven't come around to collect all the dyes to do that but at least uh, they are somewhat sorted these are the stone ones these are the wood ones those are miscellaneous and then here we have garden ones food ones another one those are also uh, uh stone and dirt but on to the uh, uh main subject uh, of uh, this video. Uh, today I want to talk about equip equipment. So basically how I organize my inventory, what tools I have, what enchantments I have on them. Um, yeah, so let's go uh, through them. Um, first, armor. On the helmet, b basically I have uh, on all the uh, armor pieces I have protection 4 and uh, mending of course. Um, maybe uh, fire protection on, f on one of two of them would be good, especially when going into the nether. But I don't think I need uh, blast protection or uh, protect. Uh, projectile protection on them because um, well usually I'm good at uh, escaping those kinds but of course on the helmet uh, aqua affinity and uh, respiration good for working on the water and on the boots depth rider and feather falling four and then uh, elytra of course uh, mending and unbreaking then uh, inventory wise i have the food in uh, in slot nine so uh, uh, you can either scroll through with the uh, mouse wheel or you can quick select with the uh, numbers nine one two so I have my food on the 9 and the rockets on 1. And usually I have uh, uh, torches in the uh, offhand. Um, this is especially useful when I go mining. Uh, so I can uh, uh, hack down the blocks and then every so often just uh, uh, place a torch there and what does not work for me is basically have the uh, rockets in the uh, offhand because every so often uh, uh, a rocket goes off uh, when I don't intend to so uh, rockets in the main hand for more intentional use then down here I have sorted out the uh, uh, tools and weapon slots. Uh, my sword is on the second, then 
um, or let's have a look uh, in the inventory the sword has of course unbreaking and mending on it uh, together with looting which I think is is a must um, and then I went for the combination of uh, smite 5 and uh, sweeping edge um, and I think I'm quite happy with that then the bow um, is a power 5 flame bow with infinity and I know there is a big argument uh, uh, going uh, over uh, infinity bow versus uh, mending bow but uh, my reasoning is uh, you can come by bows uh, quite easily and uh, if XP is not an issue you don't really need the, the mending on the bow but if you're a uh, uh, heavy uh, if you're a heavy bow fighter you can go through uh, quite a bit of uh, of arrows so just having one slot in your inventory filled with arrows uh, I think that's that's the better deal here then I have two pickaxes uh, they only uh, differ one is the silk, pick touch, uh, silk touch pickaxe with efficiency 5 and uh, the other one is the uh, fortune one uh, and uh, just well based on what you what you need you use the one or the other then an almost broken shovel which only has efficiency 5 for the shovel I think I would go with uh, with silk touch uh, mainly for uh, mining gravel to not get uh, the the flint uh, but then I would also need a, a second second shovel with uh, well maybe not fortune on it but uh, uh, without uh, silk touch uh, so you can get dirt blocks from grass blocks then um, very uninteresting uh, X and that's mainly because somewhere in here I have lots of uh, spare X's that I got from uh, uh, trading so uh, basically I'm just using them until they're broke and uh, once I'm through all of those I will get a really good one and while we are in here um, the here on the uh, right side I have uh, six slots reserved one is for arrows then ender pearls flint and steel a bucket of water just in case you uh, need one um, uh, then sticks and wood is always good uh, I also usually uh, carry around uh, some some iron uh, and the chest uh, with all the rest of your goodies in it and a shield so basically that leaves quite a bit of uh, a space open and I know there is a, a big discussion or arguments that there is just not that much uh, inventory space but I feel this this is enough what I struggle with is uh, that uh, I uh, only have two open spaces left on the uh, toolbar so whenever I have uh, go building with a wider variation of blocks I will have to uh, uh, switch out quite a few of my of my tools so uh, I have them readily uh, accessible which is a bit of a, of a nuisance so I guess I mean we, we have uh, here one two one two nine and we also could use 
the the zero that would get us uh, one more uh, uh, block but um, other than that i'm i'm quite happy with with how this is and uh, i think having too much uh, inventory space can get the feel um, to be a bit uh, uh, overpowered and with that i uh, go to sleep and i wish you a happy day or a happy evening and thank you for watching and i will see you in the next one bye